Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be cooking a grilled cheese. Let's get right into the cooking. These hoes ain't worth it. This is like relationship advice that I'm going to give you. Do your own thing, man. You know what I'm saying? She's probably doing her own thing at the end of the day. Everything takes time. Some Sometimes shit takes time, you know what I'm saying? But then again, don't listen to me because I'm not a relationship guru. Yo, I was dating this one girl. She was a freak freak. Hey, yo, me too, bro. My ex, she was kind of low-key a freak freak. So we're gonna get the ingredients for the grilled cheese. So usually I'll be using that grilled cheese thing over there. You see, hiding in the corner. But today we're gonna be using a pan. You feel me, ladies and gentlemen? We're gonna make a pan grilled cheese. Oh yeah. You, you know the bubble wand plastic thing? She was sucking that big thing sticking out of the, whoa, damn, really? God damn, yeah, she a freak freak for sure, for sure. She kind of crazy. You know, freaks be the craziest ones. That's what I took in. Her hamster died and she buried it and took it out of the burial when was hugging it. Oh, nah, she for sure part taking in some demonic activities. Starting this off ladies and gentlemen we're gonna want to take our slices of bread oh ain't nobody really mess with this slice let me know in the comments below if you guys are eating this slice personally that's my least favorite slice of bread so we're gonna want to get this bread you feel me and we're gonna want to put some butter now we're gonna want to spread this butter nice and evenly spreading the butter you want that nice angular inclination right there spreading throughout all four corners nice equilibrium of butter balancing out that bread we're gonna want to make sure every single slice is covered in butter we got to make sure all the acres are nicely buttered up you feel me now the butter we actually put on the bread is plant-based buttery taste plant-based oils before we put this on the pan we're actually gonna want to put that real butter you feel me that authentic butter we're gonna want to put that in the and this is that cooking butter. Boom, we're just gonna wanna take a nice little slice, add a little bit more, boom, boom. We already had the pan heated up from before, ladies and gentlemen. That should start burning up in the pan, you know what I'm saying? Now, we drop down with our bread. We're gonna drop down with our bread, boom. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna need a bigger pan. So we're gonna replace this little pan with this big bowl right here. Transfer that bread over as well as that butter. Now, once the bread starts getting a little warm, and we could put our slice of cheese upon there. A nice slice of cheese. Boom. And we're just gonna let these heat up. Always make sure to wash your hands. Wash your hands. Make sure to wash your hands, Kunt. You know what? We're just gonna put a little bit of herbs in here. Sprinkle that on here. I don't know what kind of herbs these are. Woo, we're gonna wanna flip that. Y'all see? Boom. Okay, our second one didn't kind of fully cook here. But boom, this is the color that we're gonna want before we flip it. You see that, ladies and gentlemen? Golden brown. Second slice should be good. Okay, it's got that golden brown to it. Boom, that's that nice coloration that you're gonna wanna look for. Now the second slice here didn't get too browned. Maybe we'll go back and revise that. We're just gonna let it sit on the pan for a couple more minutes. Ladies and gentlemen, let's check the other side. You feel me? Whoo, that golden brown. How about this one? Okay, okay, this one's getting there. You feel me? We're gonna turn the heat off and let it just Sit there. Woo. Okay. The cheese, you see, it looks like it is perfect. Oh, yeah. That cheese looks nice and melted, as y'all see. Okay, y'all. Uh, now this grilled cheese should be about done. We're going to transfer it over to the plate. Before we transfer this to the plate, we're going to cut into it diagonally. That's the key, y'all. Uh, Cut in the grilled cheese diagonally. One, and then we're gonna wanna cut this one as well. That nice crisp crunch, you feel me? This is how it's supposed to look like in the middle. You hear that crisp crunch? That is what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen. And that is how to make grilled cheese. Without a further move, let's try ourselves a bite of this grilled cheese. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Nice flavor, butter on the pan, toasted. Mm. Oh. Oh. Oh, my. oh, that touched it. That touched the spot, ladies and gentlemen. Now that is how you make grilled cheese. 
If you like this, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And without a further move, I'll be bringing you another motherfucking video soon. Oh, man. Oh, didn't see you there. Almost forgot. I'll rate this grilled cheese sandwich a solid 4.5 out of 5. Now, that being said, y'all, once again, peace out.